Hello everybody, and welcome to Alien Architects. In a previous video, I shared my theory on why so many modern buildings, such as the Chrysler Building and London's Cheeky Egg Building, look suspiciously like rocket ships. Today, we are going to talk about something else. In the 1930s, a trashy romance novelist by the name of Ayn Rand was visited by a fully nude grey alien who through seduction and hypnosis commanded her to write a recklessly incoherent novel about an impossibly one-dimensional architect loosely based on Frank Lloyd Wright, who as it would turn out was an alien from the moon. Frank Lloyd Wright when he wasn't playing model spacecraft with fellow Nazi alien Werner von Braun, would often share his plans for world domination with New York's wealthy elite, and then he'd kill them. <clears throat> As it would turn out, 70s rock stars John Anthony West, Robert Schock, Graham Hancock, Robert Bavall, and some other guy, not surprisingly have little to say on the subject. So, how does an evil murderous Nazi alien from the moon become one of the world's premier architects. That is a subject worth discussing on another video. Thanks for watching, and if you want to survive the evil that is surely to come your way, please like and subscribe, and if you have any information on the subject, please leave a comment below. And now, a gaping Zarge special report. Did you know that simply by watching real time with Bill Maher, you are participating in a form of black magic so heinous, even the Illuminati considers it too cruel? Bill Maher, also known as the Magi of Mulholland and the Black Prince of the Sunset Strip, uses his program as a ruse to collect the DNA of each of his guests. This DNA is then used to birth diminutive clones known as geeps, whose sole purpose is to be tortured. A drug made from a rare kind of pterodactyl semen is administered, which causes mere minutes to seem like weeks. And now, with the addition of Ben Shapiro's geep, the collective suffering is being used to tear a hole in the fabric of time and space, a gateway for the Antichrist, the return of Baphomet, the unholy reincarnation of serial murderer As you can see, we have some fine pop art from Joseph Mormon. We have the famous Crosby, Stash, uh, Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Hitler. Uh, notice the shorn mustache of the famous dictator. This is, of course, Michael Stipe, the famous Michael Stipe eating the heart of a Republican. Notice the bloody, it is still beating, let's say. Ah! This is a very popular one. This is, of course, Matt Damon as the juxtaposition of uh, politics, p politics and, of course, the Cabbage Patch doll with apples. How do you like them apples? Uh, this is, of course, this is, of course, uh, the Pope and uh, Charles Manson rocking it out from real life. Ah, uh, this is, of course, Ben Affleck and Hillary Clinton as anthropomorphic lobsters. Notice the on discomfort in Hillary, the reach around. This is, of course, Bill Maher devouring uh, Lena Dunham. Uh, ah, this is, of course, the world-famous Neil deGrasse Tyson murdering Bill Nye the Science Guy. Notice the look of ecstasy and blood, bloodlust on the face of Neil. Ah, this is also taken from real life. This is me with Putin and... We are joking, obviously, misogynistically, and, uh, someone does not approve, uh, Michelle, Michael. Time for another gaping Zarge special report. Earlier this week, in what was called the greatest television since OJ, OJ, the Senate Judiciary Committee hearing of dual front door enthusiast Christine Blasey Ford proved to be a circus. A literal Halloween costume party for world dictators, Satan worshippers, and active CIA shill comedians. In her opening statement and throughout the hearing, surgically enhanced multi-hemaphroditic Luciferian 
Dianne Feinstein, did little to conceal her demented sexual proclivities before America. As just behind the wooden panel, three terrified geeps, wildly in a frenzy for their lives, filleted and serviced nine of her 11 artificial genitalia. For those of us with trained eyes, it took no time at all to recognize one Kim Jong-un himself, noted Halloween fanatic and dictator, disguised as Don Ho, disguised as a bag lady, passed off as a senator in a treasonous display of contempt designed to make a mockery of the American spirit. And just as the spectacle seemed it could be no more disgraceful, the unthinkable emerged from the smutty dregs of Hollywood, the less memorable and bewilderingly more prominent member of comedy duo and Chappelle show plagiarizing sketch knockoff Key and Peele was inexplicably in a role of authority, an expression of unwarranted surprise continuously upon his overrated and overexposed countenance. After many grueling hours of this outrageous and unprecedented constitutional blasphemy, little was ascertained save it for the accused judge's enthusiasm for the ancient malty brew. Judge Kavanaugh, a true American beer hound, a relatable and down-to-earth fun time guy. His honor cheerfully championed beer not less than 30 times during the hearing. No doubt, with the hoppy suds by his side, anything is possible. We at the Zarge had our reservations about the man until this thirst-quenching revelation. In conclusion, Thursday's reckless display of anti-Americanism is sure to be only the beginning, the first installment in a series of increasingly bizarre attempts at our values and our freedom. But have faith, righteousness in the end will prevail. For now, take heart, sit back, relax, crack open a cold, frosty Kavanaugh, and get tipsy with history. Okay, uh, hold on. Welcome to Food Printer 11. Slide to access. Try again. Welcome, you made chocolate Spoken. cupcakes. Your selection does not meet dietary requirements. Please try and try, please try again. You've selected chips. Accessing. No Your chips? Your selection does not exist. Please try again. Help! May I make a suggestion? Hmm. Legumes, fruits, and vegetables. Leafy salad selection. Please try lemons. You are intoxicated. Stand by for superior officer. Accessing service file. Accessing, accessing, accessing. Welcome to food printer 11. Please make a valid food selection. Special needs chocolate. employees. Press or say yes. Handicap mode on. Napkins. Aggressively. Aggre aggressive behaviors will detected. Not be tolerated. Huh, just wait. Wholesome mm. meal required. Napkins for food customers only. Position detected. Safe destruct. Hey. Straight up. Three. Hold on. Three. Two. I did verify. That does it. Hey. Come on. What gives? How about it? Come on. Hey. Ow. What you gonna take? Huh? To make a selection, use the touch screen. Real G sucks. Mm. Wait, wait. Whoa. Whoa. Get in shot at, get in shot at. We got one more! Can this new gig, sir? Right now. This might be 
get up. James, call me. Oh. I took a bullet for him. I'm sure glad James Comey got to live. Oh, James Comey. Head of the FBI. Oh. This towel used to be white. Oh. James Comey. James Comey. That was so. Uh, it was an honor to die in your stand. Oh, oh James Comey. So glad uh, that I got to die. I just took a bullet for James Comey. I took a bullet for James Comey, and I'm proud I did it. I just took a bullet for James Coleman! Oh, you hear 
the eye. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, I'm done. Thank Jesus you. Christ. Okay, we are recording now. You know, sometimes people ask me about space. Yeah. It's all around. Sure, yeah. All up everywhere. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's indescribable. I'm sure it is. Space, that is. Yeah, yes, yes. Man. What? You know what it's like? No, I don't. It's like... Uh, tell me what... Damn, why are you here? Why you gotta ask me questions that are so un unbelievably difficult to surmise? Why? What? Why? Okay. One time I met the Shah of Iran. Really? Yeah. Anyway. I don't know, it was in Berkeley, I think. Where is this going? So, no, I don't mean to change the subject. Okay. There's, uh some things that we need to do before uh, we can populate space. But, 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 but what? But, but what? But what? But, but, but. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, yeah. Wanna do a line? Huh? Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, So I was uh, busted out. hanging out in uh, uh, Birmingham, Alabama. Bullshit. No, 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 it's not. <laughs> okay. They're drilling. Who is drilling? Right now. Who, who, where? When? Where? Who is drilling? Underground. Underground they're drilling. They're drilling right now. Ah. Oh, okay. Hey. Why are we whispering? Why do you want me whispering? Look out. What? They're crazy. Who's crazy? They're, who's crazy? Well, they're doing it for the natural resources. Bible Bites. I'm your host, Noah Shepherd Pope. Today, we're going to talk about the Mark of the Beast. Let's take a look. What is the Mark of the Beast? Mark of the Beast is a credit card, and I'll show you how. If you take the first two letters, that is the Roman numeral for six. The next letter is an S. That looks like a five. Five plus one is six. Ah! Oh! It's happening. That's the power of the Holy Spirit, your power of the Lord. What a miracle indeed. Oh, oh, oh yeah, it's happening. Oh, oh, this is scary. This is, here we go. This is stigmata. Stigmata. What a miracle from the Lord. It feels like burning nails. This has got to be the worst headache I've ever had. So you're driving along at about four in the morning doing barely twice the speed limit and you see the old familiar flashing blues. So you pull over, put out your joint and dump your beer out a hole in the floorboards, quickly cram your Beretta and cocaine under the seat next to you, and after about a minute or like 20 minutes or like an hour, Officer Big Shot comes tapping on the glass with his police issue flashlight and asks you for your license and registration. You're like, yeah, sure, whatever. But then he asks you to show him your proof of insurance. I'm like, what the heck is that? What does that even look like? So you say something cute off the top of your head like, how about I just cruise over to your place and meet your wife? Well, I don't remember what happened after that, but I didn't have to pay a ticket. Plus, now I got a titanium plate in this size fake now. Liberty, liberty, 